Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna go ahead and do a review on the Pro D Handle Bar, the 30 inch length from Jim Pin. Now if you guys don't know who Jim Pin is, it's a UK based company that is known for creating the Jim Pin. Now the gym pin is basically a pin that you can go and add on to any selectorized unit to increase the maximum amount of weight that you can use. So I have one, it's a very useful tool, and if you guys haven't already picked one up, I do recommend you guys grabbing one. So let's get back into the review of this Pro D Handle. Now obviously the name D Handle is used because it's meant to be able to put on D Handles. So as long as you guys have a carabiner, you can pretty much take any D Handle you have laying around your gym and use it on this bar. Let's go ahead and talk about some of the specs. Like I said before, this is the 30 inch version. So you're looking at an overall length of about 30 inches. Mine's about 30 and a quarter. You're looking at a thickness of 0 0.406 inches thick. And then the width is gonna be about one and a half inches. This thing only weighs about four pounds. So it's gonna be relatively pretty light. And it's made out of 10 millimeter cold rolled steel. So you're not gonna have to worry about this thing being maxed out when it comes to the weight capacity that it can handle. So it's gonna be a very small footprint. And what I like about the fact of the one and a half inch width is it means it's not gonna hang down that far compared to something like the Prime Fitness Short Bar Long Bar, which uses a very large oval carabiner to go and attach the handles to it. Now the design, although it's simple, it's gonna allow so much versatility to your home gym. Now there's going to be 13 large diameter holes on the bottom portion of this bar, and then there's gonna be 12 smaller diameter holes on the upper portion of this bar. So the larger hole is gonna be about 0 0.620 inches, and then the smaller hole is gonna be roughly about 0 0.350 inches when it comes to the diameter. Each one of these holes are going to be spaced one inch on center. Now the reason why it's important to have all these different holes is it's gonna allow you guys to be able to use a D handle or any type of single handle really. And it's gonna allow you the adjustability in order to find the perfect anatomically correct position for your body. So instead of having to worry about an attachment that was made and manufactured at a certain length, you're going to be able to adjust your D handles or whatever single handle you're using to the correct position that's gonna feel the best for you guys. One of the added bonuses that I can see is due to the fact that it has these holes on the upper portion. If you guys have a functional trainer, you can go and use this bar and you can link your functional trainer using this bar. And that's gonna allow you guys to be able to use both stacks when doing your exercises. So you can link it and then you can just add your D handles onto this bottom portion of the hole and it's gonna allow you guys a little bit more versatility when it comes to your functional trainer. So I wanted to go and point out, guys, when you buy this bar, you're only going to get the bar itself. You're not gonna get any carabiners and you're not gonna get any D handles. So the bar itself is what you're paying for and it's gonna be roughly about $110. And I'm in the USA, so my shipping was around $37. So depending on where you're at, shipping isn't too crazy excessive because like I said, guys, this is a UK based company. And the fact that they were able to ship that for $37 is really not that bad. When it comes to the exercise that you guys can do, it's pretty much your imagination, really. Obviously you guys can do rows, you can do tricep extensions, bicep curls. I've even seen people go and attach this on to their low row and then add some daisy chains to the bottom portion of these with the carabiners and then add some cufflinks to do leg extensions, leg curls. It's quite a large amount of exercise you guys can do using something like this attachment. So guys, I hope you all enjoyed this review. If you guys did, make sure you guys hit that like button. If I missed anything whatsoever, you guys can go ahead and drop me a comment. And as always guys, if you don't wanna miss any future videos, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Otherwise, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Take care.